Hello, hi, I'm Shane Kicked Hybrid, and this is Seeds of Time. Now, Seeds of Time is a 2D puzzle platformer in which you get to try at least to stop the 2012 Mayan end of the world prophecy. Now, I know that that's in the past now, but in this game, it's very real, so we have to stop it. Let's go. And apparently, the way to stop it. Oh, look how cute. Okay, that's the end of the world, that's not good. So in order to stop it, this boy will go into a Mayan temple and... Well, I guess you go to the source, right? It's kind of weird that he doesn't really have anything on him, just a lamp. That's kind of weird. But what can we do? By the way, I'm playing with the controller, but the game does have keyboard support. Okay... I don't know there were... Bridges here, but okay. Ooh, hello, pickup! Alright, we got ourselves our, the first power, the Hourglass Spirit. And with this one we can switch between the past and present timelines. So this would be 2012, and this is all the way back when the, this Mayan temple was, well, freshly constructed. Ooh, can't go there, okay. I've seen this mechanic in other games too, and I really like it. I like switching between between timelines. See, in this one, there's a pit with lava. This one, there's a pit with lava, but we have a bridge for it, so... Good. Alright. Oh, poor statue. Okay, water here. Okay, so I need to switch. There we go. Okay. Let's see what we got here. Hmm. Okay, can't go there. Ooh, there's a heart down there. Okay, I need to get that somehow. Eventually, I'll have to get that. Okay. Nice. I did not know that, you know, the Mayans had this type of technology back then, but okay. Oh, hello, new pickup! See, this is only in the past. Very important. Alright, we got it, and this is the bounce plant. This is our first seed that we collected. So, okay, so this works, you plant the seed in the past, and after the deed is done, you'll be able to bounce to your heart's content in the present. So this is the past, I can put down the seed, and if I switch, instead of the seed, we get a bouncy plant. And I bet that's the way to get that heart back there, wait. I have to go back. We have to go back, Kate, we have to go back. Here, exactly. So, put the seed and jump. Nice. Okay, need more seeds. Ooh. There we go. Nice, so now we have four hearts. Four hearts. Alright, let's continue. I'm gonna switch to the past, because I, I, I really like how the temple looks in the past. More so than in the present. It's, it's not as dark, you know? I like the light. Bounce. Okay. What do we have up here? Another pickup? No? What? Huh. Oh, come on, I really thought there would be a pickup there. Okay. Whatever. It's okay, I don't need anything. Whatever. Whatever. Okay, we're going deeper and deeper into the Mayan temple. Oh, and the save point is only here. Oh, hello. Hello, little fish. Okay, so the fish attacks and destroys... Okay. And destroys the walls. Okay. Cool. Uh. Oh. Oh, wait. Oh, save point. Okay, good. Let's switch. I really like switching between... Oh, what do we have here? Oh, another pickup, a shield! A shield, eh? 
The Hamster Shield. Uh, so this shield protects you from a single hit. Don't worry if the shield breaks. It'll regenerate in a few seconds. Okay, cool. Okay. That looks pretty nice. Okay, so it's available in, in any timeline. Okay, cool. Oops. Oh. Oh, hello, fish. Uh, whoa. Okay, I need you, fish. I need you to destroy this for me, okay? Come on. There we go. Good fish. Good boy. Oh, one of the... See, I like how all three statues in the background are, you know, uh, nicely arranged in the past. And then present. One knocked down pretty much halfway. Alright. Oh. Okay. Cool. Okay. So I can push boxes. Well, kinda. Push or pull? Okay, pull. Okay. Mm -hmm. Nice. Another... Oh, another seed! What do we have here? This is... The Boost Plant. With the pollen, you'll be able to run like the wind, wild and free. Okay, so it's the same setup. You plant it in the... Oh, sorry. You plant it in the past, and in the present, you got super speed. Hey, nice. Okay, cool. Uh, the only thing is that you can't have... Oh, well, that was weird. You can't have... What the fudge? Oh, go away. Actually, wait, no. Up. That's a weird thing, but okay. Up. Okay. Okay, let's jump. Okay, I need speed here. And yes, we got it. Oh. Yeah, baby, we got it. Uh. That is a lot of lava. Good thing I don't. Okay. Oh, oh no, wait. Uh. Okay. okay. No, no, not this one. This one. Up. There we go. Mm. I'm gonna keep it in the past. Okay. Oh, that's fine. Jump! Anything here? Oh! <laughs> I, I, I felt the... Okay. It's alright. Uh, okay. Oh. Uh, push it? Anyone around? No, okay. So I definitely need to push it on this. Okay, there we go. There we go. What do we have here? Just platforms? Okay, platforms. That's fine. That is perfectly... Oh, so I can only go in one direction. One direction... Oh, I see a fish down there. Uh, okay. Hi, fish. Wait. Because I need to see him from afar. Okay. Come on, little fishy, 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 fishy. Whoa, good fish. Bye, fish. Bye-bye, fishy. Alright, can I... S oh, I can't switch anymore. Why? That's weird. Oh, is it a boss? Oh, yeah, it is a boss. Oh, crap. It's a freaking Mayan boss. Whoa! Well, that's cool. I don't, I don't know why that happened, but... Oh! What, what the hell? Ouch. Oh. Okay. Oh crap. Oh no, wait. Okay, wait. Switch, come on dude. Oh crap. Okay. Come on little fish. Oh no, not you. You! Come on fish. Whoa! Okay, good. Uh uh don't hit me. Oh. Whoa. Come on fish. Come on. Whoa! Nice! Yes! Crumble! Crumble and... what?
Is he... Oh! Oh, we did it! Oh, come on! Okay, so that was a rather abrupt end. But I guess we saved Earth. We saved the planet from the the end of the... Well, from its end, basically. So, everyone, that was Seeds of Time. Actually, I, I think it's really cute. I just... It's kind of funny that it finished so abruptly. Uh, this here are the lovely people who worked on it. This, uh, this game was made as part of a course at the DigiPen Institute, Institute of Technology. So, um, you know, really nice work on that, especially, you know, being a school project with obviously limited time and, um, <laughs> and I guess, you know, the pressure of, you know, doing something that's gonna be graded, I guess? I'm not really sure if it's graded, but it's a really cool game. I would definitely recommend you check it out. You can download it from the DigiPen site. Um, there's a link in the description uh, if you want to get it. Um, it's available for Windows. I don't think it's for other platforms, but who knows? Maybe they'll um, they'll work because it, it's it's powered by the Unity engine. So in terms of in terms of multi-platform support, you know, Unity is really good on that. So maybe, maybe, maybe um, it's gonna be you know compiled for other. Uh, other platforms too, Mac OS, Linux, but uh, for now, you know, the Windows version is available, check it out, try it, you know, tell someone about it who made like, you know, puzzle platformers, because it's a cute game, it's free, you can download it, no problem, just again, see the link in the description below, that was Seeds of Time, everyone, thanks so much for watching, if you like this video, please, please, please give it a thumbs up really quick, and if you like what I do here, Consider subscribing, that would be actually immensely, immensely helpful if you could subscribe, tell other people about the channel, spread the word, check out the back catalog too, because I have over, ooh, let me see, at this point, 2270 videos, so there's tons and tons of cool games to discover on there, mostly indie games, so um, you're not just gonna see a billion episodes of Fortnite, which, uh, you know, for people who want to do that, that's fine, I like discovering you know, um, new things every day, and that's why I cover a metric ton of titles, and you can see lots of coverage on the channel, so check that out, check out the back catalog, and if you can, take half a minute to see the ways through which you can support me, you can either give me a direct donation through, pay through PayPal, or you can support me with the purchases that you make on the Epic Games Store, the Humble Store, Fanatical, all you have to do in those cases is either use an affiliate link or a creator tag. And when you do that, you basically tell that store to send me a small percentage of the money you spend. It doesn't cost you anything, you don't pay anything more for the stuff that you buy, so it's a very, very small thing that you can do, but it goes a long way. So if you, you know, want a Humble Bundle, you know, Use the link, use the affiliate link before, you know, buying it. If you want, you know, a fanatical bundle, same thing. If you buy something for Fortnite or for, you know, you buy a game from the Epic Games Store, same stuff. Use uh, use the codes that, uh, that help me out and again, that would be greatly, greatly appreciated. Last but not least, try out the Brave Browser, download it, refer a link in the description. You're gonna like it, it's a browser that's... Uh, focused on privacy and it's open source it has a built-in ad locker it's based on chromium so it's gonna it's gonna be very familiar to you if you use chrome if you use opera and uh, I've been using it for more than two months and it, it replaced chrome for me and it can do that to you too successfully if you just uh, you know try it out let me know what you think again I've I've used it I like it I definitely recommend it so check it out Ray Rouser, link in the description. Thanks again everyone for watching, and until the next time we see each other, have an awesome day!